Hello everyone, how are you doing? You are welcome back to my channel, Sarah English, and you are welcome to the 30 day English challenge, and this is day four. In our fourth lesson, it is going to be about the adverbs. So first of all, we should know what does it mean an adverb. So an adverb is a word which describes a verb, an adjective, or another adverb. Adverb answers one of the following questions. How, when, how often, where, and to what extent. An adverb, or the adverb which answers the question how, is called the adverb of manner. Adverb of manner describes how an action that carries the verb happens. For example, quickly, slowly, easily, sadly, and loudly. As you can notice, these adverbs are ending with L and Y, but not all the adverbs end with L and Y. Let's take a look at the following examples. My friend is walking quickly. She is talking slowly. They did the homework easily. She cried sadly. She plays the music loudly. Here, the adverbs are in red and they are describing how the action in green happened. An adverb or the adverb which answers the question of when is called adverb of time. Adverb of time describes when something happens. For example, now, then, tomorrow, yesterday, last week. Let's take a look at the following examples. He forgot his lunch yesterday. He's playing football now. He was a singer then. I will travel tomorrow. He finished his project last week. The adverb which answers the question how often is called adverb of frequency. Adverb of frequency describes how often something happens. For example, always, often, never, sometimes, seldom. Let's take a look at the following examples. I always wake up early. I have never visited Marrakesh before. Sometimes he forgets his homework. He often plays the guitar. They seldom play football. The adverb which answers the question where is called adverb of place. Adverb of place describes where something happens. For example, inside, outside, here, there. Let's take a look at the following examples. They like to play inside the house. Their friends play football outside. Come here. Look there. And finally, the adverb which answers the question to what extent is called adverb of degree. Adverb of degree describes to what extent something happens. For example, almost, fully, rather, perfectly. Let's take a look at the following examples. They almost finished the project. I am fully prepared for the exam. I am rather busy. Their presentation is perfectly presented. So this is the end of this video and this is the end of this lesson. I hope it was clear enough for you. And if you like this video, don't forget to click on the like button. And if you are a new visitor to this channel, don't forget to click on subscribe button so that you can see the following videos. Thank you so much for watching and goodbye.